is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. This reading here is for my Scorpio Zodiac signs. I hope y'all are doing well. I hope y'all have an amazing week and happy freaking Monday, y'all. Woo woo, okay? This week's gonna be a short week for me. So, hopefully, hopefully, this week, I ain't really gonna be doing nothing because your girl not really cooking too much this year. So, uh... Me, I have more time. Extra days off work. Whoop whoop. Okay, so I'm gonna try to upload some because me and my kids gonna be at the house chilling. All right, <laughs> but anyway, let's see what's going on. What's the what's the tea energy for the week, y'all? Let's see. Please, spirit, can can we just can we have some good stuff? Let's see what's going on with Scorpio. What's going on with Scorps for the next seven days, please, spirit? What's going on with Scorpio? All right, we got dreams and healing. Okay, I like this. <laughs> woosa, woosa. Okay, so we got number three dreams. What is this in my sleeve? Ouch. Some of y'all could be getting downloads this week here. I just heard, damn, that was some good ass sleep. So some of y'all going to be getting some really good sleep this week. Okay, healing on the bottom of the deck. Maybe you haven't been sleeping well. I see you sleeping better. Just feeling like at peace, having good dreams. If y'all have been having like, I don't know, nightmares or something. Somebody, been, somebody hadn't been sleeping well. Somebody feels like are crying themselves to sleep in some sort of way here. What is going on? Here we go. See, it always goes left. How teachable are you? Unleash your creativity and victim consciousness here. Somebody... Somebody play, okay. Somebody is sleeping well. Look at how she's sleeping on this tiger. Feel protected. She feel like she cool, calm, collected. Ain't nothing happening. On the other hand, there is somebody that is learning a lesson that it's like one person's healing and they're sleeping well, in good sleep, having great bomb sleep. And then there's another person that's trying to heal, but I don't know what they did. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh, but I don't know what they did, but it's something that they created. They conjured up themselves, and now they're playing victim. Like, well, I didn't, you got to understand, well, when it happened to me, I don't know. They just, I don't know. How teachable are you? Somebody, there's a lesson to be learned. It's like there's a lesson between two people. One person is like, they're taking the lesson, they're, they're healing from it, they're moving forward, moving on. And it's like whoever unleashed their creativity in this situation, they're playing victim, victim consciousness. And it's actually destroying them here. Look at this woman's dress. Like, it's people screaming in this thing. It's snakes and darkness and, and evilness here. Honey, what the fuck is going on? Long and behold, you over here sleeping like a little princess, a little prince, you know, like... I'm good. Somebody's not sleeping too well this week. Hmm. Interesting. What's going on with Scorpio? Next seven days, please, Spirit. What's going on with Scorpio? Next seven days, please, Spirit. What's going on with Scorpio? Clover, release your guilt. Okay, because somebody's guilt is eating them up. 21. 2 plus 1 is 3. You got 3. In dreams, so three, three, or the number three could be significant this week. Some okay, so somebody is guilt free. Somebody like, shit, I ain't did nothing. I'm good. Baby, I'm over here healing. I'm living life. I'm loving life. I'm enjoying life. I done tame the beast within. I done, you know, resolve things here. I'm just over here like la 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 la. And if somebody else is like not sleeping, it's like I don't know some type of energy, something they conjured up. Some type of energy they put out. Now there, it's like backlash, backfire. Return to sin. I don't know. Flower, be honest with yourself. Oh, it's justice. Look, witch, justice is coming. Thank you, spirit. Okay, so somebody getting justice here. This is karma. One person, this could be you. You over there, just like bitch. I'm good. I'm sleeping good. I'm just, you know. Slide outside and mouth, wake up, you like eh, type of energy. 
And then there's another person over there. They like, <laughs> like they can't sleep. They seeing shit, you know. Oh my gosh. Let me adjust myself. Hold on. But we got to happen to the hell of y'all. Hold on. Okay. Let's do this. We're going to use the Fire Witch Tarot deck. And then we're going to use the What's the Tea deck. Okay, to see what's going on. Oh, wait. No, y'all. I didn't read the book. Hold on. Back up, Les. Hold on. I got to read the book, y'all. Believe in your own magic deck here. Let's see. Number 21. I'm moving too fast. Okay, here we go. You've been carrying the burden of guilt on your shoulders for far too long. It's now negatively impacting all facets of your life and making it impossible to function. You've come to a crossroads where you need to choose a direction. Go ahead and make your reparations or release yourself from the cage you've built around yourself. Can't. Sometimes the first road leads back around to the second. So somebody might have had to learn a lesson. Somebody might have took a trip, okay, on this first road. It's for the Brody Road, okay, and they might not have made the best decision here. But when when it comes back around, okay, because backfire, okay, when it came back around, somebody's like, okay, I learned my lesson. I'm good. I'm I'm moving on over here. But somebody else, <sighs> okay, clarify the clover with the dreams. What's this about? Clarify clover and dreams. Unwanted opinions, people giving you unsolicited advice or feedback egotistic person there could have been somebody you know trying to warn this person don't go down that road that's not your cheese that's not your opportunity that's not meant for you you know somebody could have tried to say that but somebody was just like mind your business now mind your business okay and um it just it didn't turn somebody was in that ego Stripped and cleanse, you're being purified by spirit. And why are you so obsessed with me? Somebody's obsessed with you, Scorpio. In some sort of way. Hustler, always hustling, knows how to get what they want. They want you. Something about your newfound energy. Something about your clear, your, your clear energy, your, your clean energy. What's this? over with the dreams card. Somebody's not seeing somebody as pure anymore. What? This ain't gonna make no sense. What? If I clover with the dreams for Scorpio next seven days. Bad deals. Because somebody done got into a bad deal with somebody. Or somebody got into a contract with somebody they shouldn't got into a contract with. And now somebody's looking at you like, wow, look at how strong Scorpio is. Look at how Brave Scorpio is to have moved forward or to moved on from something here. What? What the hell is going on? Has been through a lot. Can't trust them. Power hungry. There could have been somebody that was so power hungry, like they were willing to do any and everything to win at all costs type of energy. And, like, this person was willing to, like, take you down, knock you down, trip you, fight you, talk shit about you, whatever. Because I told you, now somebody's trying to play victim. What? Maybe somebody didn't want to hear that. Maybe you was telling this person that. Now somebody's seeing that they can't trust somebody. What's at the top? See, this is why I've I've this is why I just pull the cards. I'll be trying to, but I I don't be knowing what's going on. But yeah, somebody wants a second chance with you, Scorpio. This person that wants a second chance with you, um, either was involved in some type of emotional abuse towards you or was doing the emotional abusing. Second chance and emotional abuse. Mm-hmm. This person, I mean, and you know, they might not have done it purposely, but this person could have emotionally abused you in some sort of way. Maybe tore you down to make you feel less than, to make them feel better than. Or they let somebody else come at you here and kind of, you know, just put you down. Twin flame. Some of y'all dealing with the twin flame or a deep soul connection here. 
married. Some of y'all could have been married to this person or in a connection with this person. Insatiable female, never satisfied, always wanting more. It's like this person had marriage, had commitment, had a deep soul connection, but they still weren't satisfied. Oh, God, I hope that didn't happen. I just, okay, I seen a woman pointing at a man's private part. So this person could have, like, talked bad about somebody's sexual organs or um, sexual parts. Or a woman's sexual, I don't know. This is crazy. What's going on with Scorpio, please, spirit? What's going on with the clover and the drinks for the next seven days for Scorpio? What's this energy? I can't get past this. Who? Who is this? Abused. You're being abused and need help or you're the one doing the abuse. Somebody was very abusive here. And I feel like you heal from that. And again, the, the bottom, the top of the deck, somebody was playing victim. Like they were playing victim like they didn't do it, but they did it. Or this person, okay, say for example, say this person was like, oh, they left me. They, they did this to me. They did that to me. Da -da -da -da. And then it all comes out that this person was hitting on you or talking bad about you. I don't know, whatever they was doing in a relationship. And now somebody's side-eyeing them like. Tyrant, cruel, oppressive ruler, uses force to control people. Whoever this person is, they're not a nice person. Okay, let's just be real. Gamble, taking a risk. And psycho. Some of y'all are dealing with somebody that's a little off the rocker. This person ain't right. Or they participated in abusing you or coming at you. Maybe I should say coming towards you, coming at you to make you lose your mind. They could have called you crazy. And you were like, you don't understand this person is doing this, this, and this to me here. And this person was able to, look, bipolar disorder. But this person was able to play it off like they didn't do anything wrong to you here. This could have happened in the past. So people could have been looking at you like you was crazy, like you was bad shit crazy, like you was out of your mind. Some of y'all dealing with somebody that has tattoos or could be a tattoo artist. People could have been looking at you like you're out of your mind. But now there's somebody feeling guilty because here you are resting easy while other people are going through chaos again you've already you know you know went this route you know maybe you went the wrong route right you came back to the same route where you began and then you went on a new route because you was like fuck that i'm not going through that again but some of these people have never why am i feeling like some of these people have never witnessed this person for who they are Somebody seeing how manipulative somebody is, how abusive or how controlling a, per, a particular person is here. What's going on with Scorpio? Next seven days, please, Spirit. Like somebody's finally seeing it for, for what it really is. Oh, that's too many. Clarify Clover and Dreams for Scorpio, please, Spirit. Clarify the look. Your luck is about to change. Somebody is seeing you as lucky or the good luck charm. Or seeing you as blessed, like, oh my gosh, you're blessed to have made it out of that. Or you're blessed to have moved on. Sexual connection, strictly sexual. Grass looks greener, but it's artificial here. So this person could have, like, cheated on you. You know, it could have been a very sexual-based connection here. Or this could have been somebody that they was having sex with here. That could have been coming at you or coming towards you in some sort of way. You know, maybe they was cheating with somebody. This person really thought that they had them a... a, a, a a happily ever after, okay, a prince charming, only to find out that this person is nothing of such. It was just a sexual-based connection here. But this person was able to abuse the situation. Maybe made it look like you were the one that was crazy, and they were actually the one that was crazy. Single woman, not the committed type, what I tell you. And happy relationship. This is someone that painted a situation like, 
Oh, it was a loving, caring relationship. You know, I really was doing any and everything for this person. And this person just didn't want to be with me. They just didn't, I don't know, they just didn't want to be committed to me. But they didn't tell that they were abusive, neglectful. Again, because somebody was playing victim consciousness. But you over here sleeping well. Somebody else is going through guilt. So somebody believed this person over you and then they could have like attacked you or came towards you or talked shit about you. Jump into conclusions. Thank you, spirit. Somebody jumped to conclusions. This is like only knowing one side of the story and then like taking that one side of the story and be like, oh yeah, I believe everything. This is this is like a person, okay, say there's a relationship and they say, well, this person used to hit on me all the time. They used to do this. They used to do that. But they don't tell that they used to beat the fuck out of this person. And then this person, when they finally hit them back, when they finally defend themselves, they catch it on camera to be like, see, this is how abusive this person is to me. Oh, this is giving me narcissism. Like, you know how they poke the bear, they gaslight you to piss you off and be like, see, see, this person is crazy. Switching up. They're switching up on you. Now somebody's starting to see that. Mm-hmm. Soulmate, divine soul connection here. Somebody's starting to see that. This is somebody that you had like a soulmate connection with or this could be a twin flame soulmate dynamic, honey. Okay. It's too many damn things. It was a deep soul connection. It was some, something that was fated to happen. It was meant to happen here. What's going on with Scorpio? Next seven days, please, Spirit. Somebody about to be triggered. Somebody about to be peed off. In their emotions, okay? Looking you up. They watching you online, looking you up online. Watching what you're doing, researching you here. This person could feel left out in the cold or having financial problems or something like that. Happiness hater. Yeah, because you're moving forward. You're moving on. You're being happy. You could have gotten into a new relationship, new connection. You're really standing in your power here with the queen rise. And, you know, stepping up. If this person was this type of energy in the past, they didn't like not having control over you. You see what I'm saying? They want control over you because if they have control over you, they can make you feel we small, right? And then you can't move on. You can't feel like, oh... I'm amazing just the way I am. You you know, you wouldn't be able to stand up in this energy. But see, you've overcame that here. Now somebody's looking at, this could be other people watching. Like, oh, you sure? Sure Scorpio was like that? Wasting time once you back. This person wants you back. Are they going to change? No. They're time wasting. What's going on? This person is triggered by you this week, though. What's going on? And it could be because that victim consciousness that they've been playing is no longer working. Justice is being served here. Incarcerate. Yeah, this person's stuck in their head here. Cloud hungry. See, they've been going around making shit up. They could be saying, oh, I'm a great business partner. I'm a great partner. I'm a great husband. I'm a great wife. I'm this. I'm that. I'm this amazing person. Da, 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 da. Um, but yeah, it's uh, unbothered, dusted off. I feel like it's not working anymore. Bad reputation. Maybe they was trying to get back into your energy. They're just trying to get back into your energy or something like that, and it's not working. They're going to try to trigger you this week. Be careful, Scorpio. I feel like you're not. I feel like you're not going to worry about it though. What's going on with Scorpio next seven days, please, Spirit? Dodging a bullet in reverse. Don't don't interact. They lost their chance, or you did marry for money here. This person could have used you for money, took advantage of your time, energy, efforts. Doesn't have to be money, okay? It could just be they wasted your time, your energy, your effort, you know, your heart, bad reputation, dirty offer. This person couldn't offer a solid offer if they, if they were sitting on Santa Claus' lap. If they, you know, if 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 the Lord Himself stepped in front of them and they was like, "Hey, I need you to offer this person a solid offer," they couldn't do it. This, uh, Carlos, some of y'all, this person might have. Uh, Really ruin their reputation with you. And they know they can't come towards you here. But they're still going to try. But they're lying. With that cloud hungry energy, they're still lying. They're not even, they can't even be honest with themselves. What's going on with Scorpio next seven days? What's going on with Scorpio next seven days, please, spirit? A closer look nosy up in your business here. Moving on, thank you, next. They see you moving on, Scorpio. So y'all could be moving, relocating, 
uh, change of jobs here, too busy winning. Good things are happening for you. That's what it is. Good things are happening for you. And this person sees it. The more they look you up, it's the, the, the angrier they get. Oh, Lord. The more they look you up, Scorpio, the angrier they get. Listen. <laughs> when this person tries to come towards you, see, they're, they're, they're conjuring up a game plan, okay? They want to come towards you. They want to talk to you. They know nothing good is happening for them. Here, you got Faith Flex and the Stalker. They know when they come towards you, they're going to have to come towards you with something good. So what, what's going, what are they going to do? They're going to make some shit up. This person is going to put on a show. Acts rich, flosses money, acts fancy, shows off, etc. This person may, you know, start posting pictures, you know, start bragging about something that they doing. Some, I don't know. Dumb shit, really. Yeah, hustling. Oh, yep, here it is. This person's going to come off like, oh, I make money, I grind, I do this, I do that, I make all this money, I'm this, this, this. This person, they're doing this so they can get your attention, okay? That's why. They they want you to gravitate towards them here. Some of y'all, this person could have already done this here. What's going on with Scorpio next seven days, please, Spirit? Oh, yeah, I'm about to lay down. <laughs> What's going on with Scorpio next seven days? Happiness hater. If you're moving on, this person, they're watching you and they are pissed. They are livid. They don't like that. Running, lonely, lonely, lonely. What the fuck? Facts. Facts, lonely, and running. And fake smiles. This person's trying to run away from this, this face, this mask falling here. This person's been lying. They are feeling so lonely and they're trying to like... They're either trying to come towards you or they're trying to fill that void here in some sort of way here. But this person, if if you ask them, like, are they alone? Are you feeling alone? Do you miss? They wouldn't admit it. Or if, if this person was, uh, like, somebody was to ask this person, are you happy for Scorpio? No, they're not. They feel left out from you. What's going on with Scorpio next seven days? Chasing in reverse because you're not chasing them no more. That's their karma, bad karma. Yeah, this person's going through some type of karma situation here for the way that they treated you some of y'all they watch you from a fake account here they want to come towards you here with the travel card but this person could have flipped out on you or changed up on you in some sort of way with this tripping on you card but you're no longer chasing this person you've let this person go what's going on with scorpio next seven days and they don't like that they want an offer from you but the thing is they haven't changed same shit just a different day whooping sheep's clothing kissing ass Child neglect. This person just don't like to feel neglected or abandoned or left out in the cold by you. What? Let me, hold on. Drink some coffee, honey. So this person just don't want to feel neglected. But they haven't changed. Nine times out of ten, if, if, you know what? Keep it to yourself, Liz. What's going on with Scorpio? Next seven days, please, Spirit. What's going on with Scorpio? Next seven days. If you're not happy and you're not willing to change, how do you think you're going to be happy? That's stupid to me. What's going on with Scorpio? Next seven days. Wasting time. They lost their chance, so you did. Yeah, creativity muncher. You may look at this person as a user, as somebody that takes advantage of you in some sort of way here. You feel like this person, they're, they're stuck. Nothing's happening. Nothing's changing in their life. They could be this. This is the type of person, like, they live in the same, 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 let's say, apartment, house. I don't know. They've been in the same apartment, same house, which that's cool. That's okay. But it's like they've worked the same little bare minimum job. Nothing's changed in their life. You know, they're not making any more money than they used to make three, four years ago. Um, they're not trying to get an extra job to make more money. They're not trying to do anything to to change their life. But it's like, but they mad at you because you know, step that, you know, put your energy and your effort to change your life, evolve your life. And they're mad because they're stuck. But they want to come back in your life. They want to have access to you here. Yeah, idol, love, respected, admired, idolized here, running. It's like this person, 
I just heard you could have had it with me. Fishing for comments. Hustling. This person, it's like they've been running away from you here only to watch you as you come up. What? This is crazy. <laughs> Bad karma. They lost their chance. So this person, could have, they knew they respected you and that you were supposed to be loved and admired, but they ran away from you anyway. Fake flexing to go towards something else, like act, being somebody they're not or flexing like they were doing something. Haunted memories, flashback memories, side effects. Now they're haunted by this, kissing ass, bad karma. They want to come back towards you here. They could have been kissing another person's ass as well. It's like somebody, yeah, they was in their ego, cock blocking, broke ass. Now they're having money problems. They ain't shit. What is going on? Forcer, queen rising. This person, they're trying to come back towards you here, but it's like they're trying to figure out how can I come back towards Scorpio. Some of y'all, this person, they went out there and they, they was out there, you know, living their best life only to find out it was a facade. It wasn't real was fake. You you weren't flossing like that. You didn't have money like that. You weren't getting bitches like that. Pulling dudes like that. You know, all that stuff. You were just in your ego. They're haunted by that, though. They wish they never did it. They realized they wasted time on an offer they could have had with you here. Drama started. This has brought a lot of drama into their life and this low vibrational energy that they're in. Ooh. What's going on with Scorpio next seven days? A lot of drama conflict in, in, in their life here. Some of y'all have seen it with this popcorn all around here. Y'all sat back and w watched it or y'all have seen it here. Fake accounts in reverse from your own account. <laughs> Lonely, impersonated. This person could have been out there, you know, booed up with somebody that was trying to be like you or pretend to be like you in some sort of way. Oh, Lord. Some of y'all could have had drama on your social media or y'all have seen some type of drama on social media. That fake accounts in reverse. What's going on? The Scorpio next seven days, please, Spirit. Or you're going to see some drama going down on social media. What's going on with Scorpio next seven days, please, Spirit? Uninterested in their head, overthinking, stressed, overanalyzing. You're no longer interested in this person, and it worries this person. They're stressed about that stalker. So now all they can do is sit back and watch you. But they also have a grudge against you here because they feel left out from you. Scarcity, but it's their karma, bad karma. It's their karma to feel left out from you here because of the way that they treated you, the way they wasted their time with you here. Something about this, they could have accepted an offer from another person and realized it was a waste of time. Only to find out they were living off of their ego or in their ego here. And now all they can do is sit back and watch you because that it's a missed opportunity. I don't know what this reading is about or for who, but honey, I'm I'm over it now. <laughs> Give me a couple. Let's see. What's what's growing here for Scorpio next seven days? Please, please spirit. What's going on, Scorpio, next seven days? Pregnancy test, promiscuous here. So y'all could be finding out somebody's pregnant. Crush and parenting. This could be somebody you already have kids by or children with here. That um, this person they're crushing on you, or you have a they have a crush on you, or you have a crush on them, or something like that. What's this pregnancy test with this crush and parenting? coming in after you so this person could have went off and had a baby with somebody else or got involved with somebody else was talking about having you know started a family with somebody else here and now this person's coming towards you but they've already betrayed you here with this envy energy here very jealous or trying to make you jealous here by going towards someone else building a family building a life with somebody else they tried to make you jealous what i don't know what scorpio next seven days i don't know what scorpio yeah, nightmare and then getting played. So it's like they, yeah, running away. It's like this person could have ran away from you, went off, started a family with somebody else or started, you know, building something with somebody else only to find out that it was a complete nightmare and they want to come back to you only to find out that they played themselves because now you've already moved on. 
Yeah, protecting yourself. You're protecting yourself from the situation. Yeah, sexual protection. They can't have sex with you no more. They can't get back into your energy here. You know, you're actually running away from them now. You don't want anything to do with them now. And so they kind of like manipulated themselves or played themselves here. They tried to play you. They played themselves. Wow. Burning evidence, salt or sugar. Now they want to like... Water under the bridge, this energy, like, oh, well, you know what, let's just put that water under the bridge, act like it never happened, you know, I want to vibe high with you, I want to be with you, I want to be in alignment with you here, like, they want to be on your path now, all of a sudden, I mean, okay, anyway, Scorpio, this is what I have for you, for the week, I hope this gives you some clarity and some insight, I appreciate y'all so much for watching, catch y'all in the next video, bye guys.